Ty now taking Susan Morton, trying to whip her in and right to the back, the knee of Steve Bragg and to the lower back of Susan Morton, the NWA World Ladies Champion. Can see victory in her sights now. Picking Morton up is Leilani Ty. Takes her down for the cover, one, two, and a kick out by Morton as Leilani Ty didn't hook the leg. And I can't, now Bragg's back up there again. Once again, gonna put that knee in the back. Reversal, Leilani Kai goes into Steve Bragg. Leilani Kai turned around trying to figure out what just happened. Argue with Steve Bragg. Susan Morton, roll up, one, two, three. She beat her, she beat her. She just beat the NWA Women's World Champion. You know the board of directors, now what are they gonna do? They've gotta give Susan Morton a title shot for the World Ladies Championship. She just beat her. One, two, three, Leilani Kai in the center of the ring. Susan Morton here at Mule Days, victorious over the NWA World Ladies Champion. Welcome back to NWA Main Event. Lee Tidwell and Jeff the Crippler Daniels. And Susan Morton getting that big victory, non-title, be it that, over Leilani Kai. Yeah, that was tremendous, tremendous down at Mule Days. Right here in the ring, you have got the NWA Mid-America Tag Team Champions. The Heartbreakers taking on a, a group out of uh, the Indianapolis area. Spaz and Big Mike D making their way down the NWA main event the past few weeks, uh, trying to make a name for themselves out here. Spaz gives him a shot. A knee lift into a bulldog. It didn't quite get a hold of Valentine's head. And they got a hold of it that time. I'll now tell you what, hey, these guys look like they're not going to be pushovers. They're coming out here taking it to the tag team champion. And Valentine cutting off Big Mike D for that rake of the eyes. Now a big punch to the side of the head. Big day here on TV today, Lee. A lot of footage from Mule Days. Amazing card. Oh, right there. what, what a, a side, side slam. slam. He's got, got it. Got to the cover, hooks the leg. Only a two count. Almost upset here on the champion. And what about the big surprise Ronnie Brown said he'd have today? The big Texas hangman, Lone Star, making his presence known in the NWA and taking it to Rex Sexton. Is him and Mikey Woods doing a number on Rex before that big tape fist match oh. tonight? Caesar's got a hard head. I tell you what, that's what you call teamwork and sacrifice right there. The Heartbreakers will do anything it takes. Ronnie Brown's money aside, these guys can do it. Ronnie Brown tells him right there, hey, you better go back to Indy. Back to Ben and shoots him across. Double shoulder tackle taking him down. It's Spazzy in the ring. Now for the cover is John Caesar. One, two. And a kick out there. What's Mike Porter going to be able to do to combat something as big as Lone Star? I don't know what you can do to try to stop Lone Star. That guy's a monster. He walks and talks and does what he pleases. Look at, look at Caesar. Just fold him over. What strength and power by John Caesar here on television this morning. Snap suplex. Now down cover once again for Caesar, too. And a kick out by Spazzy. He barely got his spaz. It's not Spazzy, I don't believe. He, uh... Barely got that shoulder up. Spaz, my bad. It's, uh, Valentine tagged in now. Valentine, double underhook. Picks him up. Drops him down. Look at the power of Larry Valentine. This guy is no slouch. He spends his time in the gym. And he's a worthy champion. I just don't agree with the whole Ronnie Brown money thing. Not many people do, except for the people that get loans from Ronnie Brown. Well, I heard all the boys been hitting Ronnie up for money. That's why he brought Lone Star in, so nobody don't rip him off. I was going to ask for money. Tag in and doesn't know about it. Caesar comes in and just kicks Spaz in the back of the head. He laid that boot right at the base of his skull. I tell you, it'll ring your bell, Lee. Big matches tonight in Columbia, like Chris Gatlin and Steve Lane taking on Hammerjack and Tommy Big Figure. To hell with that. Tonight in Columbia, I'm going to be TV champion, Lee. That's all anybody needs to know. Gypsy Joe and Donnie Fargo. Donnie Fargo, Captain Redneck himself, Made Donnie it. Fargo. Came to Mule Days, attacked Gypsy Joe during his match with uh, Hammerjack, 
and just busted him wide open and left Joe Lyon center of the ring. Well, I tell you what, Gypsy Joe is a tough, tough man. And Mr. Fargo, you better drink you about a six pack before you get there because Joe's going to hand it to you. If you want to see Mule Days um, and you wasn't there, you got to buy the tape. And you'll be able to buy the tape starting next week. We'll have all the information as Valentine now down for the cover and only a two count of kick out there. I tell you what, these guys aren't giving up. He looks like he don't have anything left in him, but he saved just enough to get that shoulder up as Larry sends him for the ride. Oh, ducks the clothesline. It's passed. That's now comes back off. Double clothesline. Both men down. Center of the ring. The referee's going to start the count. Who's the new ref? Uh, Tim. Tim Blades. Tim Blades. That's what they're telling me. Brand new referee coming in here to NWA. Doing a good job this morning. There's the big man, Big Mike D. This guy's about six foot six, about 290, and he's taking it to the Heartbreakers right now. Larry Valentine says, I think I'll step out here and take me a little breather. Oh, and Spaz trying to hit him out of the way. Caesar hard to the corner. Big Mike D. There's a big backdrop there on John Caesar. Now for the cover, hooks the leg, upset time, no, two and a half. What a feather it'd be in their cap to get a victory here over the Heartbreakers this morning, Lee. He's picking him up now, going for a big slam. Picks him up. One-handed body slam. Did you see that? Valentine taking it to Spaz on the outside. Big Mike D up to the second rope and a punch right there to the gut by Valentine, who now picks him up. Drops him down with that big power slam. And now Caesar all the way to the top rope. Caesar with that big hand right in the shoulder, right in the heart of Big Mike D down for the cover. I told you you had the hardest hit in NWA main event. John Caesar and Larry Valentine getting the victory here on Spaz. And Big Mike D, there's Lone Star in now. Lone Star's coming in. That big Texas Hangman's in the ring. What's he doing? Lone Star, the big splash in the corner on Spaz. Now they're taking Big Mike D, whipping him to the corner. Full head of steam. Bam, and he just hits him again. Oh, my God. He's annihilating guys here. What has Ronnie Brown done? Let's see, Ronnie. The family now has all the belts. We've got all the money. Beautiful women. Oh, oh, Margaret, she's sexy, isn't she? Oh, the love of my life. <laughs> Hi, Margaret. What do we do the hot shots on Mule Day? Should beat them like the punks they are. We outdrew everybody on Mule Day. We did what we said we were going to do. We highlighted. We were the main event. We drew the biggest crowd. We got all the belts. We got all the money. We got big members. We got new members. Small members need not apply. You see, what we have here is the Texas Hangman, the Bulldozer, Lone Star. And what he's here for is to take Ronnie Brown's money and do whatever Ronnie Brown says. You see, the family, Mikey Woods, Lone Star, the Heartbreakers, we're on top of the world. Mike Porter, there's nothing you can do about it. This Saturday night in Columbia, that's not worth talking about. But what I am going to talk about is you, Sudden Impact. We heard you running your mouth on TV. You keep running that mouth, boys, and you're going to get what you ask for. Cassidy O'Reilly just nailed John Caesar, now working on Larry Valentine. Backs him in, whips him across, reversal by Valentine. Ducks the clothesline, it's Cass. Cass head spray, back out on hits him. He's down, down for the cover, hooks the leg. Two, oh, and Caesar saves it. Caesar just saved the tag team championship for the Heartbreakers. All four men still in the ring. Chase Stevens picking up John Caesar, right hand to the side of the head, making two double team here by the Hot Shots. It's Chase Stevens and Cassidy O'Reilly taking. Caesar just threw him to the outside. Two on one in the ring. Steven working over Valentine. Whips him in, jumps across, picks him up. He's got him up here. Cassidy O'Reilly all the way to the top rope, catches him. Desiree's up on the side apron now. Cassidy O'Reilly all the way up, playing to the fans a little bit here. He might be taking way too much time. Hits him with a frog splash, frog splash. Mean Mike Woods is coming to the ring. Mean Mike Woods, he's got the sock. He's got the stomach kick.